Taylor Swift is beginning National Poetry Month as the Artist of the Year for the iHeartRadio Music Awards. The era's tour singer didn't walk the yellow carpet or appear at the awards show in Los Angeles. The Backstreet Boys, AJ McLean and NSYNC's Lance Bass introduced her award at the Dolby Theater. Swift was up for nine awards and she took home three. The iHeart Radio Music Awards celebrate the most played artists and songs throughout the past year. Taylor won the award for Artist of the Year, beating out nine other artists for the coveted prize. She's now the first artist to ever win the award twice after previously taking it home in 2015. She also won Pop Artist of the Year and Tour of the Year. I wanted to say thank you so much to anyone who voted for this award. I heart you've also just been so incredibly supportive over the course of my entire career, but especially this year has been pretty spectacular. I am so grateful for that. You know, to the fans, it's completely up to you to choose how you spend your time, what concerts you want to go to, what music you want to make, the soundtrack to your life, and to anyone who has included me in those choices. I'm so, so, so thankful for that. And you know, we have so many exciting things ahead of us. I'm continuing on with the tour, and most importantly, I have a brand new album called The Torture Post Department, which comes out on April 19th, and it's 